This country has lost one of our greatest treasures, Aretha Franklin, the queen of soul, a title that she more than earned with a voice that could raise any roof from the church all the way to the White House with a heart as big as her voice and a soul, a soul that helped to power the march to freedom for people of color when she insisted, as she always did, on R-E-S-P-E-C-T, respect. Aretha Franklin sang for presidents, even bringing President Barack Obama to tears in this performance. This is the Kennedy Center Honors, 2015. Aretha's saying for every one of us. Across America, I'm one of them, have been playing Aretha Franklin's music, celebrating her life, incredible life and career, and singing along to their favorites. This is one of mine right now. And I love this song so much because of the beginning to the piano. She's playing the piano here. It's her cover of Sam Cooke's You Send Me. personal for me as you can probably tell one of the greatest blessings of the work that i do is that i get a chance to meet and have conversations with some really incredible people more than once i've met a hero of mine but nothing compared to getting to know aretha franklin miss franklin you know in a lot of ways her music her voice it's been the soundtrack of my life maybe yours too for as long as I can remember, I've been listening to, there we are at a birthday party. I've been listening to and loving Aretha in my house, at picnics, cookouts, at parties, in the car, on the plane, wherever I could listen to her. And the people who work on this show have heard me sing her songs more than a few times, even in the commercial breaks here in the studio. They have to listen to me. But sitting down across from her just a few years ago, I was just about speechless. What you want? Baby, I got it. It's early. What you need? You know I got it. I can go to heaven right now. <laughs> Don't do that. Don't do that. Her whole life, Aretha Franklin raised her incredible voice in song. But she also raised her voice to fight for justice. 
Do you think we're, your songs were the anthem to civil rights, to the civil rights movement? So many songs were Well, played. respect was yeah. a, a mantra for the civil rights movement. It was. Do you feel we're moving forward or, or fast enough? Or? I think that we have come a very, very long way. Uh, we've come to the forefront in many fields, of course, entertainment, sports, and so on. But we still have a long way to go. And in a never-before-seen interview for an upcoming CNN original series, Aretha Franklin talked about the early days of the civil rights movement and Dr. Martin Luther King, Jr.